that song. Bring the, bring the clean it. <laughs> um, this year we're dedicating today to a young man that I never even heard of until a month ago. And uh, the 24-year-old trader on the 104th floor of the South Tower, um, when he was six years old, his father gave him a red, red bandana. His held on. Um, his father told him this. He gave him a white one. He said, "This one's for blowing, and this one you keep with you." And he went to Boston College. He wore down there all his athletic helmets. And again, he was on the twenty, one hundred and first floor. When the planes hit, he called his mother and told him he was all right. He went down to the 87th floor and he found a bunch of people injured and planes everywhere and they were huddled in front of the elevator that was never going to come. So <clears throat> basically, he found the stairwell. But how they how he came to come to that 87th floor is when they looked up through the smoke, here comes a guy with a red bandana and he's got a woman over his shoulder. So he basically said, get up. We're leaving. Period. He went down 15, 17 flights with these people. Went back upstairs. So he returned around. He was gone. And they don't know how many times. They know twice he went. They don't know how many times that he made that trip. His father in Teaneck, New Jersey, was a volunteer fireman. So was uh, Wells Crowder. And. Uh, I'd never heard of him, and the somewhat writer that I am, I said I got to write a poem about this. And it was, it was one of the more difficult things I could put to words. And Chris says, "Finish it, and I'll put it to music." So he forced me to start writing the thing up again. So <laughs> um, that's what this dedication is about. Go on YouTube, the Red Bandana. It's the one with the 13 minutes. Bring lots of tissue for that. So we're going to do one more song. I want to thank you all for being here, as always. Although we've had new people here. Um, and I made it, and I'm not bald. <laughs> <laughs> Chris. <laughs>